Good morning and welcome back to my channel. So today we are just spending some time at home. I wanted to show you these. These are play guns my husband and his brother made when they were younger. My mother-in-law has saved them and our boys like to play with them. Uh, cops and robbers and they really have a lot of garden here to do so. We are putting this table together. My husband and I brought this table up. A friend of ours was getting rid of it. My husband painted it, uh, oiled it, and it's looking really, really beautiful. We did it a couple of years ago. And I'm keen to get it out so I can have my coffee here in the mornings. But the weather hasn't been the best. But today it's a little bit of blue skies. And this is what it looks like uh, from the house. We've got quite an extent of garden. And then the yellow house is down that I'll take you for in a bit. So this table opens up, as you can see and this middle section comes out and we like to have it opened up because we are quite a few of us when we sit together and then we did bring a umbrella now a little disclaimer we haven't put the umbrella and once we do i will take some shots but it started raining later on in the day so we didn't put the umbrella we just put these chairs out and fixed the table because it needed a bit of tlc and then it really needed to attach the bottom parts to it we took it apart so we can put it in the shed over the winter it's not feasible to keep it out here it's too much snow and we couldn't find these screws so we had to find them uh, so we did manage to put the table together and now it will stay here all of summer my brother-in-law and them are coming later on in the month as well as my husband's coming back up with his cousins and the kids so then they are probably going to use this a lot and the weather will be a lot better as well so the kids are playing out there we are cleaning there was a little bit of dirt on the chairs i'm giving them a little bit of a scrub wherever i see any dirt and then i'm just getting everything ready so hopefully tomorrow i will be able to have a cup of coffee out here but i'm not holding my breath because the weather is not looking very good for the next few days So this gadget my father-in-law made um, just to prevent the rain water collecting in that pipe when we don't have the umbrella on. It was really very clever. So this is the rest of the garden here. I'm walking out. This is the barn, as you can see. Um, you usually board up the windows just because it snows really heavily here and all the snow falls on the windows and you want to be able to cover them up so this is the house that we stay in it was built in the 80s like i said by my father's father um my husband's uh far far his grandfather uh to live closer to his mum in the yellow house now uh, we built in this deck or my parents-in-law built in that deck uh it's looking a lot nicer these are some of the wild flowers that are growing in the garden now, this is a unit that we purchased for the mosquitoes so sitting out here with that mosquito protection is not going to work so this is the mosquito the thing and it usually catches a lot of mosquitoes now i can't really see what's happening in here and i don't know if i can open this one it works on this and then it's plugged into the barn over there wood when my in-laws come in the winter and that's the house from the back and the land stretches all the way down there so as you can see the yellow house is over here and then you just have to walk over a little bit to have
you have the water down there and then usually people like to come and camp out here um that's not so many campers this time around uh, but uh, you have a few people and they like to come and swim i won't be getting into that water it's really really cold and it's a gloomy day today it's nothing very it's not very sunny unfortunately but there will be people swimming Unfortunately, the light is not very good, but this is the view of the water. It literally takes us five minutes to walk down here. Come on, boys. Now the change will come. Nice, 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 we're gonna add in the butter and we're gonna make some chocolate balls very quick recipe for you okay and the kids can all help these are the ice creams that we bought uh, they are called glass boats which means ice cream boats and halal lockers uh, raspberry and licorice they're really <laughs> quite decadent and then my son bought this one as well this is very also typical to swedish it's called a sandwich um, and they love it here as well so the ice creams at the shop a single one of these was uh, 20 crowns but we got an entire box with six of them for 39.90 so the kids got to buy a box each that's not normal here Okay, so you get a spoonful like this in your hand and then you just roll it up, try and keeping it into a small ball and then put it on the table. And once you've done all the balls, it's time to roll them into some sugar, uh, pearl sugar or in coconut. Uh, I will do a recipe uh, properly on my channel at some point. So I hope this vlog has been interesting to watch. Don't forget to tune in tomorrow and I will see you then. Bye bye.